So the disease, pathology and disease course started off from my teaching very much more intensely realising that there was a lot missing from pre-conception through conception birth and right through to death. So I wanted to call it birth to death really, um, but pulling along as we went all the development of the body into states of pathology. So we start off in, in with babies and, um, well we start off pre with babies and then we work through birth and childhood illnesses and all the things that are presenting to parents possibly. And then working through adolescence and into through sports injuries and things that happen to people more commonly when they're young and then as pathology disease uh, emerges later into quite deep pathology. I tried not to end the course on death, but at some point along the way, I think we need to understand how, as therapists, we can help people through that process as well. In the pathology and disease course, it, it is important that we understand where the allopathic Meds, medics are coming from. So we do need to understand how they've arrived at their diagnosis. Um, I suppose that we use medical textbooks actually to back up the course and so all the information that you might need when you see a patient with a complex disorder would be in the textbook. But we don't concentrate on learning that and hoping that we'll ever remember all that. I want everybody to know where to find it, but it's really important, I think, to understand that we have to communicate with the medical profession using the right wording. But again, it's all in bite sizes, so it shouldn't be too much hard work.